welcome back. We're in the book of Exodus today, chapter 22, verses 14 and 15, on our way as we're coming to some pretty interesting stuff coming up, but here we are, and this is important too. Here are those two verses. If a man borrows anything from his neighbor and it is injured or dies while its owner is not with it, he shall make full restitution. If its owner is with it, he shall not make restitution. If it is hired, it came for its hire. So here's just another case, uh, these cases, and you know how a lot of this law is working, is uh, they're coming usually in groups of three. This isn't a group of three, but a lot of these laws coming in groups of three, and they're worked out in a, usually with a restitution plan, not imprisonment, and we're trying to get the facts. Sometimes you have the judges involved, and what we have here is, again, the restitution plan, and it's trying to be fair. So verse 14 puts it pretty clear. You know, if something is lost or stolen or dies and the owner isn't with it, it's, it's been borrowed, then the, the person who was responsible for it after it had been borrowed, that person has to re make restitution. Verse 15 has it. If its owner is with it, he doesn't have to make restitution. If it's hired, it came for its hire. So again, there's a difference between borrowing and stealing. Do you remember when Jesus took in, and took the colt, the donkey, and he walked into Jerusalem with it? It said the, the master, the Lord, has need of it. Jesus was borrowing it. He wasn't stealing it. We would say, hey, they took the car keys, they took the car, they took the, they took the donkey, they were stealing the donkey. No, they were borrowed it, and the owners got it back at the end. And it just probably seems very different to us from our way of looking at it. So anyway, just a few minutes here. We won't labor on with these verses, but we'll come on some more uh, tomorrow morning as we look start at verse 16. Hey, let me remind you that we also have, usually on Monday mornings, we have at 12 o'clock noon, America, Detroit time. Uh, we do a little YouTube live, just a short, uh, anywhere between 10 and 30 minutes, kind of recapping the different devotional videos we've done during the week, any other new presentations we've made. We'll talk about that. Sometimes we'll talk about things in the news. Sometimes we'll talk about uh, things that are coming up and maybe the Horizon Watch stuff we're doing. And so uh, we are looking at that. And so if you want to stop by on Monday, Monday, uh, America, Detroit time, uh, noon, you'll, you can tune into our YouTube live. You're invited. <laughs>